Hey what's up guys welcome to the channel my name is Miro and in today's video I'll be showing you some exciting pickups I got from last expo here in Prague. These expos they are so good. I got a bunch of different huntsmen. I got Tisseladonia which is probably the most beautiful tarantula out there if not the most beautiful spider out there. I got some really cool spider that I included as a bonus spider in the end and it's a European spider from Croatia that's all black and shiny and has a green mandibles. Really cool. Absolutely insane expo. I got three Celadonias. First, uh, first mold you can see it right here, and forty-five dollars in here. Like I said many times before, guys, the prices here are different because people make less money, but still, they don't make like four times less than what we make in the United States. So the spiders overall are cheaper. This I just couldn't pass on. I didn't want any more huntsmen, but I got seven Lunulas. So I ended up just getting one. I got two adults, so I'm hoping that one of the adults is gonna be female and this one's gonna grow into a male. You know. Dreams. Same kind of situation. Heteropoda boy. This was a pretty decent price for a subadult female. She's huge. And I have a huge enclosure for her. And I have two captive breads, which one of them looks like a male. Here is an identified uh, heteropoda species Malaysia. Don't know us have new homes. Didn't really record it because this is so tiny. Can we actually let me see if I can see if I can show you one? There is one. Oh my gosh, it's so tiny. I don't know if you're gonna be able to actually even see. This is it. Okay, let's see. This is it. Yeah. Here is one. Heteropoda lunula. I'm switching from the babies to the biggest one that I got today. Being this heteropoda boy, mama. She seems really nervous there. She keeps constantly like stretching, moving around. I also want to say this is a wild caught spider. So I have a great enclosure for her. And the only reason why I bought this wild caught spider is so I can actually breed it with my captive bred spider of the same species. So let's see. Okay, almost there. No, 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 mama. No, mama. Uh, I was hoping she's gonna stay. Let's see if we can get her out like that. There we go. Eh, didn't work out exactly how I wanted, but it did work out. You guys, can you see her? Yeah, you can see her. Finally, mommy, dad, you can stretch your legs. Look at that. You're gonna be so happy. Look how huge it is. Okay, next, Heteropoda species Malaysia. And the way I set it up, because it reminds me of the Retimna species and uh, those like leaves and they hide in leaves. I, of course, put a live plant in here that I'm, you know, hoping it's gonna get bigger. And I also put some of these leaves where it can hide, but this is a fake plant. So I'm hoping that this is gonna be sufficient enough for, um, for this uh, big mama for now. So that is 10 huntsmen today, guys. Oh, look at her, she's nervous. Don't worry, Mama. I'm also nervous. We're all nervous from this. Okay, can you see this? Yeah, you can. Okay, but well, I'm gonna try to, you know what? Let me do this. It's gonna work out for me with the lid already on. There you go. I'm gonna see if I can just do something like this. There you go. Yeah. Yeah, very similar to the Retimna species. So we'll see, maybe I'll get lucky. Let me get the phone so you guys can see her. Maybe I get lucky. Maybe it's a gravid female. I decided I'm gonna rehouse uh, the Saladonias too. I'm just gonna take like one at a time. And I'm gonna start with this one because the other two, they actually kind of build a little bit of a, um, like of a hideout. And this one is just kind of like sitting at the bottom. And I have a, Kind of a, like a perfect enclosure for her, a lot of places where she can hide. The bottom layer is a bit damp, but everything else is completely dry. So yeah, I think she's gonna enjoy it. Maybe Tessa Adonia decided to climb up on me. Really didn't want to do it. I was hoping for a quick rehouse, but since she's out, I'll take a quick footage. Very tiny. All right, if you guys made it this far, thank you so much. I hope you enjoyed this video. Here is the bonus spider. 
so common name of these guys is like tube spider or something like that and she would be probably fine in this but i would never get to take any pictures and this guy's supposed to be really cool looking they're supposed to be also really fast and have a bad bite and so i got something like this for her and uh, as you see, she has tubes here. So I'm hoping that she's gonna make home somewhere here. I put some leaves in there to make it a little tighter on her for her. And I'm hoping she's gonna stay in there. And when I feed her, she'll come out and I'll be able to take pictures. Okay, oh yeah, I can see those guys, Sarah. She's backing up. Okay, we got her in. Wow, she is cool. That is a cool spider thank you guys for watching if this is your first time here don't forget to subscribe and hit the like button and i'll see you soon all right ciao